everyone, it's Melanie and I wanted to share a quick grocery haul video with you. Um, today is Friday and we happen to be in the area around a Trader Joe's. I don't have one anywhere near my house and so this was actually the first time that I was able to go but I was so excited to finally get to try out some of the things that I've seen in other people's grocery hauls. So I'm going to quickly show you what I got and then I will also include how much we spent. I am gonna have to go to our local grocery store to get um, some milk and some eggs and things like that that I didn't wanna get and then drive almost two hours back to our house. That's how far we had to go. So uh, um, I'll go ahead and show you what I got. We're gonna start over here. I picked up some shredded hash browns. Um, this was a really good price for these, I thought. What's wrong, princess? Are you okay? Um, I got some of these garlic potatoes with Parmesan, um, some organic whole grain figs. My husband saw this and immediately just picked it up, put it right in the basket. He loves rack of lamb and I can be honest and say I've never tried lamb. So this is just something we're going to try. Hold on. I'm going to have to take care of a baby. And I Okay. So let me finish this video real quick. She is fussy, but she's sitting with her daddy. She's just really tired. Um, as I said, we picked up this rack of lamb. I, if I remember correctly, I think that this was $13.99. So that'll just be something, you know, special that we'll have. We'll probably actually have this with the potatoes. Um, so yeah, we'll give that a try. My husband saw these. A lot of the things that I got, by the way, were because my husband saw it and was like, wow, let's get that. So I got these roasted chicken patties. Um, they're fully cooked. You just heat them up. And there were two of them, I think, for like $3.99 maybe, something like that. So um, this will be something easy to, for me to make for him for lunch one day because he does come home for lunch. We got some spinach fontina and roasted garlic chicken sausage. I also picked up some of the sweet apple chicken sausage. So I'm excited to try both of those. This one I think I'm going to make with some ravioli. Um, so that'll be pretty good. And then this is another thing that he's... Oh, he picked these out, by the way. <laughs> This was another thing that he saw and he thought it just looked interesting. We've never had chicken breakfast sausage. And as you can see, it was only $2.99, which was a pretty good price. So we got some of that to try. I was completely out of ground beef. So I picked up some of the organic ground beef that they had. And it is a little bit more expensive than um, Costco or Aldi where I can get it for $6.99. But that's only 50 cents different. So it's not a big deal. And wait, is that right? Yeah, <laughs> sorry. It's been a long day. So um, I did get some gluten-free toaster waffles, just not really because any of us need to eat gluten-free, but because I want to try this and see how I do um, as far as eating gluten. And you know, if I don't have to give my kids a lot of gluten, I'd prefer not to. So we got some of those. Again, gluten-free, but really not because we have to be gluten-free. I got some of the chicken breast nuggets, the breaded chicken breast. They just looked really good. and. Um, I don't know. I like the fact that a lot of the products at Trader Joe's are raised, you know, in a way that I feel good about. So, yeah. They were sampling these, or giving out samples of these at the store, and Kyler saw them. She, she, oh my gosh, that girl loves blueberries. And this was a really good deal. I think it was $6.99. This is a huge carton of organic blueberries. So I got some of those for her. Um, garlic and cheese bread sticks. Like I said, I'm going to be making a ravioli and husband wanted some bread, so I got that for him. I picked up some cilantro jalapeno hummus because it's my favorite. I got some sharp cheddar cheese. I picked up some of this spiced chai tea. I don't really know why, but I've been craving chai tea and I've heard really good things about this one, so I'm going to give that a try. I was completely out of almond butter and as you guys know, I use it in my shake every morning. So I got some creamy almond butter, unsalted. I don't know for sure if I'll prefer this one over what I was using, but it's a small enough jar that I can try it and we'll give it a we'll give it a go. Got some brown rice penne pasta. Just because again, trying to I'm trying some things with a gluten-free. I'm not saying we are going to, you know, go down the gluten-free road. I'm just trying it and seeing if it makes a difference in kind of how we feel a little bit. I got some um, diced tomatoes, no salt added. She is really cranky. I'm sorry, guys. I promise she's fine. She's just really tired. It's been a long day. Some snack crackers for the kiddos, just because it looked like something that they might like to try. Some potato chips, um, the salt and pepper kind. 
Of course, I have a five-year-old and a one-year-old, and they adore Cheetos. So I got some of them some of these baked cheese crunchies. This was my one naughty splurge. Trust me, there were tons of things that I could have gotten, but this is the only one I got. These orange cranberry scones. This says mini. That's not a mini scone, in my opinion. It's like the size of my palm. It's okay, but regardless it looks it looks so good so i will allow myself to have a treat every now and then and i'm not sure if you can freeze scones but i'm certainly going to try otherwise i might try to demolish the whole bag and tell myself that i didn't want them to go bad and the last two things i picked up um, were some of these fruit bars the apple and banana and the apple and strawberry they also have one that has coconut i think it's apple coconut but i don't really like coconut so i just decided to try these two and the really cool thing about these is they are literally just two ingredients. It's apple and strawberry and apple and banana. So I think that that is everything. I'm looking to make sure I didn't forget anything. And I think that that covers everything that I got at Trader Joe's. Um, I am going to have to go to our local grocery store, as I mentioned, and get milk and eggs. And I can't remember something else, but something, something. I'll figure it out. So I will put that clip at the end of this one. And then this will be posted for you guys to watch on Monday, which is a few days from now. But um, yeah, I will be back soon. Okay guys, this is the last of what I'm picking up as far as groceries for this week. It's not much, but um, this is what I got this morning. I picked up a dozen um, organic eggs, some fat-free half and half because I ran out. I got this for my husband and my son because they um, just wanted some ice cream as a special treat. Yes, just a second. I got some more uh, cherries. I put these in my shakeology sometimes and I'm just now realizing that I forgot to get more spinach oh well it happens I got a gallon of whole milk and the last thing I got I had to go to Walmart to get dog food and a couple of other things so I did get this while I was at Walmart it's just this loaf of bread it's a lot smaller um, I didn't like the last wheat bread that I that I bought so I didn't want to get that one again I got this one and we'll give it a try so that's it. That's everything that I bought today. I'm going to get this stuff put away and I hope you guys have enjoyed watching.